Okay, so what do we got? You are sailing, you are preparing to sail, you guys are ships that I don't need, you can disband. What is happening on the Western Front? We are forcing them to choose where they're going to go. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Uh, this army is assembling. You know what? You guys go that way instead. No, 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 go. Oh, those are mountains. You can't go that way. Okay, yeah, go that way. Let's see if we can't force them to fight us in the mountains. If we fight in the mountains, we do have a bit of an advantage. Because mountains are rugged terrain and hard to climb over. What are you? Okay, you're not someone I need to worry about. Well, you are, but you won't bother me if I don't bother you. Which seems like a good deal to me. Okay. So, let's see. We have... Oh, we've won another siege. Oh, good, 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 good. Uh, you can go to Furstenberg, then. You guys are almost in Argal. He should start running any second now. There we go. On the 23rd of November, we're going to arrive on the 25th, but we're going to the same place he's going, so if we're lucky, we're going to get him. Okay. They are going for Bresgau. So will we. We will go to Bresgau, and then we will march over here. Ormery Fulkson. Oh, right. Ormery Fulkson. He has become a scholarly theologian. He has claims on our land. This is not the best thing in the world. Um, he's my nephew, she's my sister. They're not... Okay, different sister. Um... You know what? I'm not going to find him, anybody, just yet. He's very good, though. He's, he's a nice all-rounder. I like it. Okay, that's, that's a plus. Can you attack yet? No, nine days. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Salt. Okay. 16,000 versus 8,000. I think we can win that one. So I'm going to let him continue. We've got 34,000 men going for St. Galen. Our ships are good. Our ships have arrived. You, this way. Well, actually, they're all going that way, aren't they? You, there, you're already going. You, also there. You, also there. And then we will split once we all land in Oldenburg. You guys ready yet? You are ready. 35, 36,000. Good, 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 good. That's what I like to see. Board ship. Let's roll. Uh, where was... Yep, you're ready too. Okay, we have mobilized the army. Really? That's not enough ships? Oh, 25,000. Right. Um, okay. We need these. Get over here. You're carrying an army. Yes? Good. You have arrived. Excellent. 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 Combine. You guys can attack Cyprus first. Take Cyprus from him. Uh, these gentlemen are basically just deterrents. But I will put, actually, Damascus. Yeah, they will go there. You'll go there. This may or may not be... Ooh, yeah. Change of plans. Everybody just marched there. But I will put this entire army covering these mountains. We've got a bit of a choke point, actually, because I'm fairly certain that this is impossible too. Yeah, you have to go around it. So if we can take this and this... Actually, this and this, we basically cut them off from going into our territory without going around the mountains. That's that's a plus. Okay. All of you guys need to march up here. Who the hell are you? Really? You've got 15,000 men and you're not giving them. Son of a bitch. I need those troops. You've got 10,000. I need those troops. God damn it. Vassals. It's because they're autonomous. They don't have to give me. A, they don't have to give me Jack Diddley squat, pretty much. Oh hey, these guys are splintering too. But unfortunately, we can't take advantage of that because we're busy. Okay, 
Well, that army is stuck there for now. This army is moving down this way. They will arrive in St. Galen fairly soon. These armies are the ones that I need to micromanage. All right. 78,000. No, you need to go that way. You need to go that way. Go, 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 go. Give me some lovin'. Come on, come on. Get out of there. Get out of there. Go away. Better. All right. You guys need to assault. And you guys cannot do that any longer. Actually, no, no, no. You continue there. You will go here. Yep. All right, 22%. 28%. Good, 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 good. I am worried about this, though. I know someone in the comments is going to go, you shouldn't be worried. You've got, uh, you've got it under control. You have a good strategy. Yes, I do, but they have men. And unfortunately, this is why I prefer the Total War series, actually. Ooh, hello. Uh, yeah, change of plans. We are marching back home. And this is why I like the Total War series of games better when it comes to uh, playing a game about war. Because Crusader Kings 2, whoever has the bigger army, will generally win. It doesn't matter if they're good quality or not. Whoever has the bigger army wins. That's pretty much it, in a nutshell. And it's not a bad system, because this game isn't about war. Not really. Captain Tigor of the Kuman Band has been... Oh, good. Good. That is a definite plus. Um, no, nah, I've, I've mucked myself up. Right, uh, it's, it's fair enough, too, that it's not a focus... It's not focused on war. That's... That's not what the Paradox games are about. They're about playing... Well, some of them are, but this one's not. It's generally about playing as a dynasty and a certain character. And while war comes into it, it's not the biggest function of the game. It's just a sideline. It's a sideshow, pretty much. Hello? You think you can take me, huh? Well, I've got news for you. I've got another 16,000 men just waiting to jump in on you. Just got to time it right. They've got to move as soon as that army hits. Can you assault? You can assault. Good job. Okay. What about you guys? Can you assault? Not yet. You don't have anyone to attack. You guys are still assembling, but that's okay. I forgive you. Aha! New army. New army indeed. Um... Jump down there, and then march straight to... Oh, that's... Yeah, that's going to be a bit of attrition. March for Braunschweig. Braunschweig? Braunschweig? I don't know. <laughs> I just work here. Um, but yeah, it's not the focus of these games. The focus of these games is... The way feudal politics worked. Which is fine. If I'm looking for a Total War game, I should go play Total War. But it, it does leave a little bit to be desired sometimes that you can't fight like a... You can't fight a defensive war. There is no way that you can fight a, a proper defensive war because there isn't the game mechanics for it. And the day that they manage to combine this and Total War is going to be a grand, grand day. It's going to be the best of days, pretty much. You need to get into port so I can grab the men and go to war. God damn it. 3rd of February. If I move these guys now, he won't move, but if I wait and I engage him, hopefully we'll be able to gain a fair bit of war score from that battle. You... Oh, you're done. Good, 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 good. You can assault. You are already assaulting. Can you assault? Five days. Duke Roger of Norfolk has inherited stuff from Bernard. You're already assaulting. You're already assaulting. You need to wait two days. Victory. Oh, right. Victory here. Okay, good. 46% war score already. That is a massive plus. It's the 1st of Feb. They're arriving on the 3rd. We need to be ready. Second, you can assault. You can assault two. We need to be ready. We need to move as soon as he hits. 32,000. Okay, go. Go, 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 go. We've got the defensive bonus. But now we need to kill the bastards. 52% war score. As long as we stop things like this happening, I'm confident we can win. 
You are marching to Urbid. Can we fight them in Tiberius? No. Nope, we need this army back. Yeah, we need this army back. On board boats. Forget about Cyprus. Oh! Oh, ho, ho, ho. no we don't. We can, we can jump them in there. Don't forget about Cyprus. Keep doing your thing. Okay, we've got more men. Good, 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 good. I was worried for a minute there because as much as I have got a strategy here, it's very tenuous. They do outnumber us, and if we don't fight smart, we're going to be fighting a war of attrition that we cannot afford. Luckily, we've got another 25,000 men coming this way. Whew, this, this might turn out okay after all. Yes, I'm worried. Okay, we are winning currently. You can attack. We are currently smacking them left, right, and center. Successful siege. Good. Two successful sieges? No, just one. Okay, move to Munster. Or Munster. Uh, you've got two holdings to go. You've got three. But you finish sieging that place. How long until you can attack again? Five days. Alright, well, that's good. Okay, so we will outnumber them when our men arrive. Frida and some other woman. No idea who she is. Six days. You're arriving on the 20th of February. Okay. But we're at 73% war score now. We can keep up the momentum. In fact, maybe if we defeat this army, we'll be able to just sort of go, hey, you lost, dude. It's over. 81%? We still haven't won that battle yet, though, so... That will tell. You can assault. You can assault. Yes, I am being a bit more risky with my armies. I, call, I kind of need to. Alright, 85%. We killed 22,000 of them for 4,000, almost 5,000 of ours. Herman, some guy was captured in battle. Combine armies and follow them. You need to assault. You're already assaulting, you need to assault, and you can't just yet. That's alright. Can you? No. We've got 29,000 men marching toward us, but it depends where they go. They're going to Urbid, so they might actually be trying to attack us here, or they might just have another army that we can't quite see. I do not know. But we've got 10,000 men standing here, so that's a plus. These other guys can stand there, and if needed, we can march to the aid of these 10,000. Okay, good. Whoa, that is a 40,000 man army. That, that is bad. Okay, we need to win these sieges, and we need to win them quickly. Because if we don't... Okay, 90%. 90% is good. We need to march there. Go, 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 go. Okay, 100%, yes! Gotcha, gotcha. You will surrender to me, you son of a bitch! Hey! Victory! Yes! Ha ha! And that is how the West won. Bitch, please! Alright. Whew, that, that was... That was difficult. That, that hurt. That, that was... Whew! Whew, that, that was, that was a gamble. I was really not sure we could win that one. But we did. We did, we managed it. We, we got him. We got him. Oh yeah, gimme. And now we can get more retinue men, thank god. Whew, that, that was tricky. I really didn't think we were going to win that one. Just, just for the record. I thought we were kind of buggered. When he suddenly went, Hey, I'm attacking Jerusalem. How do you feel about this? And my first thought was, Nope, 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 nope. All of my nope. But now we're at peace. And... Okay, people still hate us. But I can live with them hating us. Actually, free investiture might be... The key... Because that's succession law. Yeah, change the free investiture in Scotland. 
Hell yes. All right. Um, okay. I haven't got quite half the votes we need, but I'm fairly certain that we'll be able to swap to Gavelkind soon enough. Nice. A son. A son. Yes. I didn't even remember that my wife was pregnant, but sweet. Aaron de Harcourt, born to Empress Simon and Empress Ingrid of the Empire, named Aaron. That is a stupid name. Seriously, they couldn't have picked something from our history. Actually, let us name him after somebody uh, somebody who did something great. Let's see. Uh, no, not House de Harcourt. Um, no, we've had a couple of Gerards. Gerard the Conqueror, Nigel, Emperor Nigel the Holy, Duke Brian, 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 Nathan We haven't had Nathaniel in a while. He shall be Nathaniel. Nathaniel. Nathaniel? Yes. There. Nathaniel. We've fulfilled the ambition to have a son. Massive plus there. And next we'll be trying to improve our diplomacy because diplomacy is a very, very important thing. And did he get anything good? Well, he got Bond in the Purple. Bond in the Purple is kind of cool, but not really something we have to worry about all that much. Uh, we will nominate, though, our actual son as our heir to the throne of Byzantium, and they might just go with it. Because the main problem was that we were uh, nominating a woman, I believe. They might be okay with a, with a male. Cool. Hell yes. Now, I believe... That because we won a war as the Byzantine... By, yes, there we go. In honor of the Empire's recent victory, it would be appropriate to hold a triumph in the capital for the heroic soldiers who fought in the campaign. Such an arrangement will be expensive, but the people expect nothing less. Done deal. We shall hold a glorious triumph. Though I don't think we'll have any slaves riding beside us in the cart going, You are but mortal. Maybe we should. The Lords of Scotland have approved the institution of free investiture. That could just push us over the edge to swap you can't swap because no vassal has a negative opinion of you is unchecked you cannot swap because no vassal has a negative opinion of you who has a negative opinion of me like a really really negative one you why because you would like Porto and Braganza under your direct control you know what I will give you that, because that's a fair enough demand. I've sort of been just avoiding these sort of things, but he wants the stuff that technically belongs to him, so fair enough, I will give you those things. Uh, transfer vassalage of Porto, I think I already did Porto, didn't I? You now want, no, I did Braganza, you want Porto. There, done, okay, good. That's, I think he was the one who hated us the most as well. Yeah, he was. What do you want? You want control of the county of Sen. Ah, you're also ambitious. I didn't know that I had control of the county of Sen, but okay. Um, I will give you Sen. If I can find it in the list. <laughs> Sen, 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 Sen. Ah. Okay, that's manageable. A negative 20. I can deal with that. Uh, how much would it cost to... Oh, yeah. Done. Done, done. Um, now... Who else is there that's negative? The Duke, you would like... Oh, okay. Basically, you're a claimant to stuff that I own. I will have to bribe you. You want Galicia? Yeah, I'll have to bribe you too. You want Sicily? I'll have to bribe you as well. Yeah, I think the rest of these guys are just going to be... Uh, you have to bribe them. But, I can live with handing out money. Actually, could I? Oh yeah, we got new um, we got new titles now because we are the uh, Byzantine Empire, so I can make you a proconsul. Why not? Can I make you anything else? Oh, I can make you in charge of the palace too. Why not? I still have to give him money, but it's still a cool thing to do. Uh, Roland, my man, Roland, would you like to be a knight of the realm? Just just because. And I will still give you money. Yeah, have money. Uh, the Doge of Capua. Can I make you... Oh, I can make you a pro console too. Oh, there's four of these. Cool. Um, okay, yeah. 
And I will, yeah, I'll still give you money. That is a lot of money, but money is money is still a good thing. Uh, the Duchess of Mesopotamia. How many more votes do I need before I can get this to... Okay, I need another... Call it 15 votes. How many does she have? Alright, Princess Valeria. Someone I need to make happy. And she's the Duchess of Mas Mesopotamia. That is handy. I don't have anything I can give you there, but I will, I will give you that money. I will give you that money. She doesn't like us very much. But eventually we'll be able to demand religious conversion from people. If we were orthodox ourselves, we could um, mend the schism. Maybe, but I don't particularly want to change to orthodox, because orthodox, if you do that, makes everybody uh, who's Catholic a heretic. And then you have to be orthodox, and orthodox is okay, but it's got some stuff that's just kind of meh. No, I won't, I won't use that. That's a little OP for this guy. I'm, pr I'm actually, yeah, I'm, I'm going to make it that whoever is Lord Inquisitor is my court chaplain. Because that just seems to make sense. Uh, now, who else doesn't like me? You don't like me. Thomas the Duke of Valois. Yeah, you don't like me because I hold land that you think should be yours. I can't give you that, sorry. So you'll just have to take this money. You don't have to like me heaps, you just have to like me a little bit. You are negative 17. You know what, I'm going to make you a Knight of the Realm, and then I'm going to make you my champion. Just because. The Chiefess of, of Telush. I'm going to have to send you a bit of money. Money is always good. The Captain of the Varangian Guard, really? Actually, can I make you the actual Captain of my Guard? No, I can't make you actual Captain of my Guard. I must have given that out already. But he's got a plus one already, so that's something. Uh, the Duke of Ulster, you, sir, are now Proconsul. The Proconsul of Hibernia. And you are going to be a Knight of the Realm. Congratulations on your promotion. Okay, so now I could change these things, but I'm going to wait until, hopefully, we've got a uh, low crown authority in Byzantium. Mighty Triumph is held. Your vassals are. Ah, your vassals are impressed by this display of imperial power. Good. A Mighty Triumph is held at the Hippodrome to celebrate the brave generals and soldiers who brought defeat to the enemies of the Empire. The people cheer as trumpeters lead a long procession that includes parading soldiers, carts filled with the spoils of war, and cages holding captives from the recent campaigns. The Empire is on the verge of success. Indeed. Roma Victor and all that. Now, have I got... Am I getting the votes? 60. 60? I need... 63, I think. Who has... Who has more votes that I could kind of bribe into... Peter. Peter of Bosnia. Yo, my man. Hey, how come you like me? Oh. Cool. Um. Well, you are an opponent of this, so how about... Actually, can I... Oh, you will take vassalization. Sweet. I will I will ask you then. Really? Peter of Bosnia? Oh, it's this. That's Bosnia. That was a little ding-ding. Is that an important ding-ding? Those are all unimportant ding-dings. Uh, no. No, no, no. Eh. Pretty much no. No all across the board. 60... Come on, come on guys. You know you love me. Just a little bit. Just a little bit of my love for you. Armand of Messina. Or you. Did I have to bribe you already? No, but I will bribe you again. Uh, you apparently have a vote too. Sure, bribed. Um, Count of Messina. You have a lot of votes. You actually like me a lot though, so I'm gonna send you a gift. Oh, I already sent him a gift. Okay. Come on, come on, guys. Come on. The magnificent Emperor Simon, I accept to swear fealty to you and serve you as a vassal lord. Good. 
Can I give you a position of some sort? No. You don't like... Now you like me less because I'm a foreigner. I hate you. I hate you. But you can be a knight of the realm. And did I already send you money? No. So I will. Come on. Come on, guys. Yes! Aha! 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 Okay, good. Uh, can we still change these laws? Yes. I cannot change... This one, I thought I could do- Oh, no vassals, no vassals are fighting each other, god damn it. Who is fighting who and why? Oh yeah, you're fighting a, um, a war for Cecilia, aren't you? Okay, what if I murdered- Yeah, I know, this is, this is a great start to my ruling the empire. Oh. She... I can imprison her, can't I? No? Oh, I can't imprison her because she's already technically at war. Can I kill her? 26% chance of success, 50% chance of being discovered. Can I plot to kill her? Yes, I can, and a lot of people would be love... They'd love to see her dead. That is a lot of people. I approve. <laughs> Good God. Oh. My reputation is ruined. Okay, but that's just the problem she has with me, right? Everybody else is kind of okay with it? Okay. Um, God damn it. Yeah, she, she's, she's very pissed off, but... But, 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 but... If she dies... And hopefully she will... Then... It won't matter very much. Okay, Baron Gerard has assembled a party of mercenaries. The roads just aren't safe anymore. Come on, kill her. Kill her. Oh, legalism. Sweet. Gimme. Thank you, legalism. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Kill her. Kill her. Really? Come on, dude. I might, might give out the kingdom to you, but I like having all of these kingdoms. Uh, yeah. Did, did we kill her? Yes! Okay, nobody knows I did it. Yes, nobody knows I did it. Does that mean I can change? Yes! Ah. Alright, change. Yes. Shits. Two Gavelkind titles is a very, very bad thing. Okay, people don't like me, but can I change Scotland? Okay, I can change Scotland. So, there. Done. Scotland. Now I just need to please people in the Kingdom of Sicily. So, who is there? You are outraged. Actually, I'm just, yeah, I'm just going to re-bribe everybody. Oh, that didn't work too well. Can I demand your religious conversion? No? Okay. What do you actually want? Ah. Let's see. Outraged by change of succession laws. But I don't have another male child, so... Assuming I don't have another male child... I don't need to worry about this. I'm not going to lose the Kingdom of Scotland. So that is a plus. No vassal counter above has a negative opinion of you. I may have to plot to kill that guy too. Okay, can I make you happy? Nope. And you're not even particularly old. Can I kill you? Possibly. Let's try. Okay. Uh, a feast might help. Maybe. But I'm not entirely sure. At least people are jumping in on this whole kill everybody thing. I'd really love it, though, if this massive golden horde would splinter. But how long is our truce? Because... I was under the impression that if you do a tribal invasion, it's one year. It's been six months, I think. Truce. Truce with us. Truce with Empress. Ten years! Yes! Okay, I thought that was massively OP when I first saw it. The whole tribal invasion thing. But assuming that that was tribal invasion that he used, obviously it has been nerfed. Thank God. Okay, so on that happy note... I am going to end the session here. 
because really we've done a lot. We've done a lot and it was grand. Golden Horde can fuck off. We won. They didn't. Nah, 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 nah. You bastards. And until next time, this is Grey Hunter saying thank you for watching and I shall see you later. Toodaloo.